What's good, y'all? This your boy Shino4757 giving y'all this nice Samsung Galaxy 3 for Metro PCS. Uh, this case that I got on here is uh, actually a nice outer box that I bought for the Galaxy S3. It's real nice. It looks sexy. It go right with the phone. It's real nice. I actually dropped my phone a few times and no damage was done. Pretty good case. Uh, cost about $39.99. I don't know if this is like the Defender series, but it defend enough shit. Alright, y'all. Basically, uh, this video basically is going to show y'all how y'all can get the, whatever they call it, the, the, cu the custom mod ROM for your phone. I don't know what the fuck it is, but it's basically uh, a ROM built from scratch for your um, Samsung Galaxy S3, and it will basically... You have to be rooted. Now, in this video, I'm not going to show y'all how to root it. That's why I'm going to put all the links in the motherfucking description at the bottom of the video. Because I'm not fucking responsible if you fuck up your phone. I have nothing to do with that shit. So, don't get mad at me when you fuck up your phone. Root your phone and you can do this process, okay? This is my shit right here, okay? This is my shit. And I'm going to show y'all the version that I'm running. I'm going to go ahead and go to uh, settings, which is located here. We're going to scroll all the way down, go to about the fucking device. Alright, uh, see, it's running basically ice cream sandwich 4.0.4, .4, okay? So just keep that in mind, y'all, just let y'all know. Okay, remember, you have to have your fucking phone rooted in order for you to do this process, okay? So basically, I'm going to be installing Jelly Bean on my phone. So this is your boy Shino4757 and... Here we go. We about to do it. Uh, first thing you want to do is power off the phone. Well, you got to download the ROM, which I'm going to give you the description in the video, of course. Download the ROM first. Now, after you do that, make sure you turn off the phone. Oh, I'm sorry. Turn the screen off. So, go to power off. Go to shut down. Yes. The device is going to shut off. Just to let you know, once you root your phone, you will void your warranty. So, like I said, I'm not responsible. If you root your phone or fuck up your phone, that's on your that's on your behalf. I ain't got shit to do with that. I'm just showing y'all that the shit can be done. So, let me unplug this charge out of here on my Nike's outer box. Close that up right there. Okay. Now, um, another thing you're going to have to have installed when you want to install this ROM is something called Clock Word Mod clockwork mod basically uh that's going to be the program that you're going to use to install the rom so once you i ain't going to show y'all how to do that shit either F fucking google it or look at the link in the bottom description y'all going to get all that okay so once you had a clock the custom clock whatever mod on your shit you're going to hold the up button the up volume rocker Hold the home button as well while you're holding the power. So we about to do that right now. And there it is. It's going to go to Samsung Galaxy S3. <clears throat> okay. Now, there we go. Now, let's see if y'all can see this. Make sure y'all can see this real good, okay? I'm trying the best that I can, all right? Can y'all see it? Alright, there we go. Now, you got these options here. You got the reboot from device, SD card, blah, blah, blah. Now, what you're going to want to do is, you're going to want to make a backup of your curtain, your curtain ROM on your phone. So, what you do to do that is, you go to backup and restore. You go to backup. Well, I didn't try to back it up, but... Yeah, I already had a ROM backed up, but... I guess it's doing it, so I'm gonna just let it do it. I already had a fucking shit. I already had the shit backed up already, so I didn't need to fucking back it up again. But I'm just gonna go ahead and do it again. I guess. Fuck it. So I'm just gonna let that shit back up. It's gonna take a little minute for everything to back up and shit and all that good shit. Back the shit up to your phone. Blah blah blah. 
got to back up all the apps back basically back up all the system shit in your phone so your shit can be snappy you feel me that way the whole point of you backing up your process is if you fuck up not knowing what the fuck you doing then you can actually restore your shit back to normal that's why you back your shit up you feel me so um, this is probably going to be the part where I just, you know, I guess chop the video on this part and then I'm going to come back so we can make the video shorter, okay? Alrighty, now as you can see it says backup complete. Now once the backup is fucking complete, what you going to do, you can see, let's see, I want y'all to see this shit, okay, because I don't want y'all to fuck up nothing. You gonna go to go back. I'm controlling it using the volume rockers. You gonna go to go back. Push the power button to select. Boom. Now what you gonna do is you gonna do white data factory reset. Hit that power button. You're gonna skip all these nodes and go to yes. Boom. So basically, it's gonna delete everything, all your shit, all your apps, and everything. Nah, it wipe the data. As you can see, I don't think it wipes your actual. It wipes everything. It wipes all your data. Okay. Once you do that, once you delete, you know, you do a factory reset. You are gonna go to wipe cache partition. Wipe that as well. And push the power button, and it's wiping it. Wipe your cache complete. You're gonna go to advance. You're gonna go to wipe this shit right here. If you can see it. Wait, 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 wait. There you go. See where it says wipe, David, cash, whatever that should say. You're going to go to yes. Boom. That shit is wiped. Okay. Then you're going to go to wipe your battery status. Wipe the battery status. Got to wipe the battery status. Okay, y'all. Uh, always remember that. Okay. That is wiped. Boom. Okay. Then you're going to go to, uh, go ahead and push that back a little bit. Okay. All that shit is wiped, right? You're going to go to go back. Okay, now, y'all downloaded the ROM on y'all phone, you know, when it downloaded your phone, y'all gonna go to install zip from SD card, which is the second from the restart system now. So, you go there, you push the power button, you're gonna go to the choose zip from SD card. So, you go there, you're gonna go down to you see download, which is located right here, then you're gonna see your ROM that you installed right here okay you gonna install this fucker by pushing the power button you gonna skip all the nodes can y'all see this motherfucker there you go y'all gonna skip all the nodes and go to yes boom there we go the process has begun so I'm gonna just keep this motherfucker right here and zoom up so y'all can see that this motherfucker is actually installing the shit Got some bootleg shit. I got shit trying to sit up on shit. Let me go ahead. Ah, uh, can see? There we go. Okay. There we go. See? Just installing the update. There we go. The shit is complete. Okay? So basically, you just installed Jelly Bean on your phone. Okay? Now, what you gonna do? I can see this motherfucker. I'm trying to fix this goddamn camera. This camera's some bullshit. Okay, you're gonna go down to go back. Power button. You're gonna go to restart system now. Now, the system is gonna restart. There we go. Galaxy S3. Looking nice, looking nice, looking nice. There it is. You gotta wait to it load up. You gotta wait to this motherfucker to load up. Now, just to let y'all know, there would be no Metro PCS boatware on your phone. There would probably be no boatware at all. It's probably gonna be a couple of apps or whatever, but it's not gonna be completely none. Okay, so y'all gotta install that shit manually. Um, you Google that shit. If y'all doing shit, mod your phones and shit, y'all motherfuckers know how to, you know, 
do other shit, okay? Y'all know how to Google and shit. There we go. Um, The motherfucking phone came on. There it is. There it is right there. It says, make yourself at home. You can put your favorite apps here. Oh, yeah. So I'm just going to press OK. OK. Oh, look at that. That look nice. That look real nice. Look at that. Look how snappy this thing is. Okay. It say choose some apps. Add an app to your home screen to the touch and hold. Okay. So just press OK from there. The clock. You can hold this shit and put a clock here if you want to. But I ain't going to put that shit there right now. So I'm going to just remove that bullshit. Okay. I want my shit to look nice and clean. Nice and clean. There we go. Okay. So first thing I'm going to do is go. See, okay, still telling me about sorting shit. I know about that shit. I got had Android like 50,000 times. All right, look, uh, that's your widgets and shit right here. All these is your widgets. If you can see, all these is your widgets. These is all the, the apps, which ain't really shit on this motherfucker. I don't even see the Play Store on this motherfucker. So you got to download the APK file. They probably get the Play Store on your shit. Like I said... Do this shit at your own risk. If you don't know what the fuck you doing, call an expert or some shit. Somebody that actually know about phones and technology that know what the fuck they doing before you install anything on your phone. Because I ain't got shit to do with that. So don't comment and say something about I fucked up y'all phone because I ain't got shit to do with it. I like this little feature right here that gave you down here called the torch. And the torch is basically, you know, the camera light. Uh, just turn that motherfucker. Oh, that shit bright than a motherfucker. Look at that shit. That shit will, that shit will fuck you up. Police get to your car. Uh, see you driver's license registration. Pull out a Galaxy S3 on y'all motherfuckers. <laughs> Alright, anyway, uh, yeah, there's nothing on this motherfucker. It's like completely empty. I don't see no, uh, I see the email app. I don't see the Gmail app. I don't see shit on this motherfucker. This bitch is like completely modified like everything modified you got a movie studio over here i guess that's you can create movies and shit that's pretty cool you got the turn the terminal um emulator right there you got the super user app you got uh apollo i don't know what that is probably another music app or some shit i don't know um but yeah this is running jelly bean i'm gonna show y'all that this motherfucker metro is running jelly bean i'm gonna go to the fucking settings right here I'm going to scroll the fuck down about phone. There it is. 4.1.2. Jelly bean, bitch. Look what the fuck is running. Yes. 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 This is nice. This is real nice. Um, uh, but so far, I'm fucking with this mother. This bitch, this thing is pretty snappy, man. This thing, this shit here is snappy than a motherfucker. Like, I got to install some shit on here first before I, you know, say. But so far, man, this shit, this shit is the truth. Um, when you install this ROM, it also helps, helps the battery. It gives you a lot of permissions that, you know, the phone companies don't give you, of course, because they don't want you fucking with their phones, like I did. But, uh, the dollar... Here's the dollar. Dollar look nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. That's the dollar. Let's see how the text message app look. Text message should look different too. This is running jelly bean. No convo motherfucking stations. Cause I just installed this motherfucking ROM. Alright, um Email app, of course. Y'all know what all this shit is. But yeah, so far so good. Uh I'm gonna try to let me let me go to the browser, just to you know fuck with this shit a little bit, see how fast it is. Um, you know I gotta load up my favorite channel, which is YouTube, which y'all watching right now. Oh, YouTube! Ooh, look how fast that is. That is very fast. Look at that shit. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me go to search. S H I N O. Oops. Put an I. Four seven five seven. Let's see what pops up on Shino four seven five seven. Oh, all my videos. Here we go. Let's see the unboxing of the motherfucking Galaxy S three. Cause I'm cold like that. Look how fast this shit load up. This shit is nice. Oh, here we go. Turn that landscape mode. 
Oops, I ain't mean to pause it. Well, there you go. Look at that. Even the browser and shit is fast. That shit is nice. This is nice. This is nice. Okay. So, um, I ain't installed nothing on it yet. I'm about to, I still got to check on it and shit and all that shit. I still got shit to install on this motherfucker. But I will be doing some experimenting things with this little bitch. So, if y'all don't feel like waiting for Jelly Bean, y'all can install it right now if y'all want to. So, yeah, like I said, this been your boy Shino4757. Showing y'all that I can install the Jelly Bean ROM. On a Metro PCS Samsung Galaxy S3 like no fucking other.